I was thrilled to watch all the public art being installed around Lafayette. And I think it inspires the community to um, actually be happier. I think it makes for a happy community. The notion that art is a non-essential item and art is part of the human condition. You have never through history or prehistory had a time when there was not art. Art is very much part of the human condition. Funding is huge. It allows funding for a project like this. More people will see more artwork. Some people won't look at it. Some people will, will in a year from now, they will never remember that a moose stood in front of Mojo's. But the people that do appreciate it, the people that do see it, they'll get it. Arts funding has a really important role because, I mean, I think clearly no, nothing is created or moved forward without some type of backing. And so I think um, the financial backing, but more importantly, that, that you say by funding it, that it is of value and of importance. You're saying that to your citizens and your community, and um, it encourages the people who are the creatives in your community to come out and feel supported and, and have a role and have a voice, and um, I feel like it's important to reflect all of that in the community. As you look back in history, it is their arts that you are curious about someone's society. You know, that's the lasting piece and mark of any um, generation, and so I think it is really important. And I feel really fortunate living here on the Front Range, I feel like, in the state of Colorado. And um, we are super fortunate to have communities that do um, not only embrace the arts, but really use it as its champion and leader to, um, to tap into the creative voice and the peop you know, the, that part of their society. And let that creative voice grow. Funding, public funding especially, is a statement of support, community-based. And, you know, let's see. It grows the arts, it flourishes it. Art Street wouldn't have those pieces otherwise. Given that these are not typically purchased by individuals, the notion that uh, larger organizations see the benefit of providing an environment in which the public can come in and have an experience that is both delightful and meaningful and has some content in it other than just shopping or what you're going someplace to buy. I think if we're decorating our environments so, so as they just merely become an extension of the economic process, what we do is we lose the delight and we, we lose the feeling that this is the best day for you right here. And small towns or municipalities really can have this kind of impact on understanding that you don't just want people to come to your town, you want them to have a good day.